YouTube! What's up? Is this too close? You sure? I think we can do the video this way, can't we? Oh, come on! You're no fun! What's up, YouTube? It's Scott Kazan, the Balloon Man, and that back there is a picture of me and my girlfriend on the jet ski, which was awesome! Oh, I love jet skis so much! They're so much fun! Anyway... Um, that picture is actually great because it um, fixes the whole TV reflection thing that's been giving me a problem because I can't move my computer and I have to deal with that fish tank behind me. But as you know, I always spend a minute just messing around and then I get straight to the balloon. Here we go. So we are going to make a ninja. A balloon ninja. So as you know, I'm a metallic tech guy. I'm a metallic guy. But Qualitex still makes some pretty cool stuff, and I still order from Qualitex, just not really my 260s. Bam! Just released Ninja Heads. These things look awesome. It really looks like a very cool looking ninja. Um, listen, I get them from Rainbow Balloons. I really don't know where else to tell you where you can order them from. You're going to have to just look around and see what you can find. But this right here... It's a big time saver. And let me tell you something. I've already been through four gigs with these things, and they're already extremely popular. I mean, I don't even have to do any more gigs to know that these aren't going to be very, very popular. So let's get straight to it. You're going to make two very small little hands. And you're going to make two arms the same size. We're going to introduce them and put a pinch twist. And actually two pinch twists would be better. Now we're going to make the body. And you already have a body and you know this is a very simple quick balloon. And I put a very simple balloon sword on one hand. And we might as well throw the ninja head on. Why not? So just right there, that looks pretty cool, right? And if you're a simple, basic twister, congratulations. You are a pretty good twister if you can make that. But I'll tell you what. I'm going to make you an even better twister. Watch this little detail I'm going to add that people are going to go crazy for. Are you ready for this? So we're going to make a red balloon, and we're going to bend on two ends, almost like an S. All right, then you're going to make a twist, and then you're going to wrap it around. We're making a belt. So come back to that spot, and twist it in. And, you know, I haven't put a pitch twist there. I think I'll put a pitch twist this time. So let's see how it'll look. And then, of course, you're going to make a second little ropey type belt looking whatever, and then you're going to break this piece off. Simple. Okay, so that looks even better. And since we have these excess tails, you could just close it out, make legs, and congratulations. Or what I like to do is put two pinch twists for knees on one leg. And what that does is that'll enable you to kind of, you know, maybe give it a little bit of style. And let's just say you did one pinch twist on the other side. It'll kind of look like he's, you know, running, like, you know, like he's on the move or something. And if you put a pinch twist on both sides, Then you could kind of, you know, bend his legs and maybe do a little bit more twists and turns. But again, you could just easily make legs and call it a day. And then we close it out. And what's really cool is that if you have excess, that little piece, you just wrap it in. You don't have to break anything, and that's awesome. So yeah, the whole point is of making these pinch twists so you can make it look like he's kicking or, 
doing some kind of uh, in motion type of look. And I mean, that is awesome for four balloons. That probably takes less than two minutes. How cool is that? I'm telling you, you're gonna be making a lot of these. So guys, if you really like the video and you know you're gonna use this design and you know you're gonna buy Ninja Heads, I need you to put a thumbs up. I really need it. It's really important. It's all I'm asking you guys for. All right, so guys, thank you for watching. See you next time.